It's no surprise or not even shocking. R. Kelly please not guilty. And for many, we would think the obvious that he would say, no, I didn't do this. I did not um, try to sexually assault these young girls. But the link for this article will be in the description. Now, according to AP, R. Kelly pleads not guilty to reworked federal abuse charges. So this was going on, people. So R&B singer R. Kelly on Thursday pleaded not guilty to an updated federal indictment that includes sex abuse allegations involving a new accuser. Attorney Steve Greenberg entered the plea on the 53-year-old singer's behalf in Chicago federal court. Kelly stood next to Greenberg in an orange jail garb, holding his hands behind his back. The 13-count superseding indictment was released last Monday and includes multiple counts accusing Kelly of child pornography. It is largely the same as the original indictment, which also had 13 counts, but includes a reference to a new accuser referred to only as minor six. Wow. So prosecutors said during the hearing Thursday that it was likely there would be another superseding indictment against Kelly in the coming weeks, though they provided no details. Now, Kelly, who has denied ever abusing anyone, faces several dozen counts of state and federal sexual misconduct charges in Illinois, Minnesota, and New York. From sexual assault to heading a racketeering scheme aimed at supplying Kelly with girls. The Grammy Award winning musician was jailed in July and has been awaiting trial at Chicago Federal Jail, a block from the courthouse where he attends pretrial hearings. He has participated in hearings in his New York case by video. Federal charges in Chicago accused Kelly of filming himself having sex with underage girls and of paying off potential witnesses in his 2008 trial at which he was acquitted to get them to change their stories, of course. Also, Thursday, U.S. District Judge Harry Lying Weber moved the trial date to April from April to October the 10th. Wow. Isn't that crazy? Now, if you or anyone that you know, experienced a sexual assault in a sinking reference called the National Sexual Hotline, well, the natural, National Sexual Assault Hotline at 1-800-656-HOPE. That's 4673. You never know who just might be getting sexually assaulted. So this is what I think about this. Yeah, they are milking this until it's dry. You know, I told you in the beginning they were going to make all the money that they could off of this cable is booming every time uh, they mention anything about R. Kelly is ratings. So now they push this back to October. We won't get uh, any sentencing on R. Kelly anytime soon. But as of now, of course, R. Kelly said 